Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So just over a week ago, I put together a video showing you guys the top three best ways to make money in GTA 5 online. And going off the feedback, it seems like a ton of you guys really seem to enjoy that video as there was at least one method in that video that all of you guys can grind out straight away and stack millions. However, some of the methods in that video have now changed or they've been updated. So I thought I'd go ahead and put together somewhat of an updated version to that video, seeing as so many of you guys really seem to enjoy it. So as always, if you guys do enjoy this video and you do want to see me cover more epic money and RP methods in the future, all I ask is you show support by dropping a like down below and feel free to subscribe as I do post daily GTA 5 videos. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so the first method I'm going to be showcasing in this video is how to complete this week's brand new time trial. It only takes one minute to complete and will earn you guys a very nice $50,000. So you really have no reason to complain. I guarantee all of you guys will come on straight away and smash this time trial at the park. Now, I would suggest you guys go ahead and use a motorbike for this time trial. There's tons of super fast motorbikes you guys can easily complete this one in, including the Sanctus, the Hakuchu, the Hakuchu Drag, the Shatoro. But in this video, I'm going to keep things mutual. I'm going to use the Batty 801, which only cost around $16,000. So I guarantee all of you guys can at least afford this motorbike. But like I said, if you guys own any of the new faster motorbikes, by all means, go ahead and call that one up. However, once you guys arrive at a time trial, as you guys can see on screen, you just simply want to get your front wheel outside of the circle so you get a little second advantage. And as soon as you start the time trial, pop as many wheelies as you can. Try and stay on the right side of this road because you want to take an instant left here. And there is cars coming from the left and the right. However, like you boys can see, it's a very basic straightforward turn. So from here, just go straight, keep popping wheelies. A very straightforward and simple time trial this week as long as you guys follow these steps that I'm showing you. Because there is only like two or three different main turns so you don't need a waypoint or anything it's very easy to memorize so feel free to add this video to your watch later list come back at a later time later tonight when you come online however as you boys can see this dodge in between the cars keep popping wheelies however once you guys see this big billboard on the left and you'll be approaching a garage on the right side you want to take an immediate right and cut through the little gas pumps as you can see me doing on screen right now this guy this will save you guys around two or three seconds it's very essential you do that it's very easy as well i whacked off the gas pump once by accident however you just want to keep pummeling down this road straight remember to keep popping wheelies however you guys will notice a for sale sign here on the right you want to take an immediate right when you see that and get off onto this dirt road now from here you guys want to basically follow this dirt road however you want to cut through the middle of it as you boys can see i'm doing on screen there should be like a little line of bushes so it should be very easy and straightforward to follow i'm doing it at night time which makes it harder however just keep an eye on your mini map in the bottom left to make sure you're going in the right direction and you should approach this little tunnel i decided to go through it because it's very easy to go through it and continue you can get you can go to the left of it my friend went to the left of it and he managed to do it very easily however all you guys want to do is just keep an eye out for this little dirt path which is kind of leaned inwards so it's very easy to make out which uh, direction to go just keep popping little mini wheelies and then you should bounce up onto this road and then from here it's literally around the corner a very easy and straightforward time trial i even eased off the gas there at the end if you guys noticed i pressed the uh, brake because i didn't think i was going to make it and i didn't want to finish it in time as if you guys don't think you're going to finish it you can simply just hold down y or triangle and it will respawn you at the start of the time trial so it doesn't really waste any time at all but honestly guys i'm going to be straight up with you i managed to complete this in my second go this is by far one of the easiest time trials rockstar games have released in the past few months literally watch my video like twice or three times just so you know where you're turning there's only like two or three main turns once you've memorized those you'll be able to complete this straight away however coming in for the second best money maker method and that is by playing the brand new adversary mode known as sumo remix not only is this game mode offering you guys double money and double rp but it's extremely fun to play i'm not gonna lie i have been playing all of the adversary modes that have come out in the last few months and this one hands down is the most fun out of all of them so i guarantee when you guys are playing this game mode time will fly by and it won't even feel like you guys are grinding money now the name itself pretty much explains what this brand new adversary mode is all about it's a remix version of of an old school adversary mode that was already in GTA 5 online known as Sumo. 
and it's practically what it says it was a sumo game so you both had to start on one big platform and then you'd have to use your vehicle to knock the other player off the platform in the given time now in this remixed version of course the maps are a lot bigger and you actually have to drive to a safe zone on the map whereas the old school game mode you just had to remain on the island this one as you guys can see you do have to actually remain in the safe zone until the timer runs down in the top middle now also throughout the game mode different parts of the map will disappear so do take note of that i've seen a ton of players just driving around the map and end up falling off the map making some really amateur moves so just make sure you guys are paying attention and that is pretty much that game mode wrapped up in one so like i said it's very easy and straightforward to understand now a few tips that i will give you guys when you're playing this adversary mode the biggest tip that i personally used and i even used it in a bunch of 1v2s which i ended up winning was to make sure that you guys always remain behind the enemy team now what this will actually allow you guys to do is time perfectly when you want to arrive in the safe zone so as you guys can see there is a countdown in the top middle map if you guys time it right you can build up enough speed behind the player to knock him straight off the map or out of the circle in the given time and i've noticed this worked for me a ton of times it's all about timing with this game mode that's why it's very unique and very fun to play because you can see level 10s beating level 1000s as long as they use their brain in the right way now if you guys are looking to make pure money from this one then there is three different payouts you can receive if you finish the game in under three minutes you will only receive 5700 if it goes over three minutes that will jump all the way up to 10k and if you guys are able to spend five minutes in this game mode then that will jump all the way up to 16,000. so you can potentially play up to four rounds so if you guys do some quick maths four times 16 will give you guys 64,000. you guys can actually earn more than that by winning the rounds back to back so you win the rounds one after another if you guys win a round lose a round win a round you won't be earning no winners bonus but if you was to win all four of these rounds back to back then you guys will be earning a very nice winners bonus for every round one so when you would be originally earning around 64,000, you could potentially earn in more around 90,000. so like i said it's completely up to you how you want to grind this game mode out i will say of course adversary modes can't be done solo so if you guys don't have that many friends that do play gta 5 online do be sure definitely to leave a comment down below with your PSN or your gamer tag. I've got tons of players always up for grinding money and helping each other out. Now, once you guys have left a comment under this video, I will leave a link to all five of my GTA 5 crews down in the description for you guys to go and check out. And once you guys have left a comment underneath this video, if you guys are also looking for an active GTA 5 crew, I will leave a link to all five of my crews down low in the description. I will say the crews do fill up very, very quickly. So I will be kicking another 100 inactive members exactly one hour after I post this video. So if I upload this video at 9 p.m. UK time, by 10 p.m. UK time, there will definitely be a space in the crew for you guys. So make sure you keep an eye out. However, moving on to the third and final best money maker method in this video, and that is by making the most out of this week's current promotion, which is offering you guys double money and double RP on all of the client jobs, which if played in the right way, you could earn you guys around $62,000 in around three and a half minutes. So we're talking about a guaranteed $180,000 every 10 minutes or so. But not only that, the great thing about these client jobs is they can be launched 100% solo. Now I have already put together a video fully breaking down all of these different client jobs and how you guys can complete them in the quickest amount of time as well as including all the different payouts so i will leave a link to that video down low in the description however what i will quickly do is show you guys how i actually grind this method out using this and another method in free roam because by doing so you guys will be able to remove the cooldown timer so you can consistently be making as much money as possible so the first thing i do is i launch the free roam session i get into my terabyte and then what I'll go ahead and do is source a vehicle now of course this is optional depending on your circumstances whether you own a vehicle warehouse or mc business or a special cargo warehouse so whatever business or warehouse you do own in the game go ahead and do a source mission for that business now as soon as i've sourced a brand new vehicle what i will do is head back onto my terabyte and then i'll launch the client job robbery in progress this mission once again can be done in about three minutes or so all you have to do is go onto your computer on your terabyte terabyte search through the cameras 
find the location of the robbery, head over to the robbery, take out the robbers, and then simply return the gold to a location. It's an extremely easy mission, hands down the easiest out of all of these client jobs. So once I've completed that, I've got a nice $62,000, and then once I've done that, I'll pull up my secure serve menu, go down to VIP work, and launch the VIP work known as Headhunter. Once again, this is another great VIP or CEO work that you can do that can earn you guys over 25k once again in under 5 minutes. And if you guys haven't played Headhunter before, it's very easy. Go ahead and pull out a Mark II Oppressor, a Deluxo, a Buzzard. Just fly around the map and you have to just take out 4 different targets. So very straightforward and very easy. Now once I completed Headhunter, I will then head over to my vehicle warehouse or a special cargo warehouse like I said, whatever you guys own and I'll go ahead and sell the vehicle from there. And the great thing about these sell missions is they're also very, very quickly. Most of them could be done in around five to three minutes. So once you guys have gone ahead and completed that, that's another 100K into your bank account. From here, I head back onto my terabyte and I launch any client job of my liking. Like I said, this is personal preference so I will leave a link to a video down low where I have covered all of these jobs but a lot of them basically will earn you guys around $60,000 so the second client job that I personally prefer to do is the one called diamond shopping because it's very similar to the very first one robbery in progress this time all you guys have to do is make your way over to the jewelry store and simply take the robbers out collect the goods and drop them off to the drop-off point and once again will earn you guys $62,000 and from here I just go ahead and rinse and repeat the same process so i'll go ahead source the car sell the car do headhunt off and then by the time i've done that the cooldown period would have ended for the very first client job robbery in progress and i just repeat the entire process again and by doing so i'm able to bag millions every single hour and it's extremely easy and can be done solo so hopefully you guys do prefer me doing something different this week and putting together more of a guide using different methods in one video of course it is worth mentioning you you guys can grind method free out with a friend so if you guys do prefer to play with someone do be sure to leave a comment down below with your gamer tag or your psn and say willing to grind method free or maybe if you guys don't own a terabyte i've got tons of members in my community always up for grinding money and helping each other out so just leave a comment down below nonetheless that's going to do it for me guys the top three best money making methods that all of you guys should definitely be making the most of as of right now if you guys have enjoyed this video and would like to see me cover more epic money and rp guides in the future all i ask is you drop a like down below and also feel free to subscribe as i do post daily gta 5 videos thanks a lot for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video peace